Hey, what is up, everyone? Welcome back to the stream. This is the Count of Monte Fizzo, and we are back with some more Sonic Adventure. Um, yeah, still a good game. I wholeheartedly think so, although I think we got through the roughest patches last time. I don't remember Big the Cat being that that bad. Honestly, Amy, like, I like I like in theory Amy should. I mean, we'll, we'll get into all this. I mean, whatever. Anyway, um, let's, uh, let's say hi to Fisto. Fisto the Hedgehog. Hey, kids. What the fuck is up? What's up, Fisto? Let's, uh, fucking get rid of this shit. There we are. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. And I did make a couple new thumbnails because, I mean, Sonic games are fucking short. They really are. So I think we're going to have plenty of time to get through quite a few of the games that have lined up. So let's just show off my other thumbnails real quick. I made a couple new ones. And of course, there's uh, the original Sonic the Hedgehog. We'll do this right on the date. There's, um, what's it? What's his name? Um, <laughs> fuck, I want to say Shadvik the Hedgehog, but I think that was in a uh, Mr. Medicare video. What the fuck was his name? Dark Steel, Cold Steel, <laughs> Cold Steel the Hedgehog, fucking brilliant. Then uh, this is a new one. This is one I just made, Sonic Spinball. After you image search uh, Diaper Sonic and Muscle Tails with the safety filter off, uh, some things can't be undone. <laughs> I think this one, <laughs> this one's really good. I actually really like the way this one turned out. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, I think I will play Sonic Mania at like the very end of the month because I hear that one's really good. Played through Sonic CD. You know, what? But this game has its problems, and honestly, the same problems that every other 2D Sonic game has. You know, that you can't see that far ahead of you. Get you get fed into a bunch of cheap bullshit. Some douchey level design, sure. Um, I still say it's better than Sonic One and Two, and it's been too long since I played Sonic Three, so I can't really say that. But I remember getting really, really suck with Sonic 3, but yeah, this game rules. I, I wholeheartedly think this is a good game. Very, very wild. That's what we're uh, listening to right now. Great, uh, great soundtrack. And obviously Sonic Adventure, Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> Hopefully this one's okay on Twitch. I feel like it should be fine. I just, it's just two gentlemen. Don't look up who they are. Don't look up who they are. And we have Sonic 3 the Hedgehog. <laughs> Sonic 3, Sonic the Hedgehog. And knuckles and knuckles and knuckles. Beautiful. Yeah. So I mean, we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have some fun this month. We really are. But yeah, let's um let's just dive right in. Whoop. Oh, don't look at that. Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. All right. Uh. Oh shit. Don't show my Discord either. Jesus. All right. Um. Why was that on the other screen? Huh. I thought I thought I uh took that shit off. But yeah, you should uh, join the Discord, though. Anyone who's watching, just just join that shit. Just join in on that shit. I promise I won't pull any um, pro Jared and like send you dick pics. <laughs> it's so fucking wild that that happened, man. Um, also, speaking of Sox CD, I was watching... I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Emphasis on think. Um, I was watching some oh, yeah. other... Oh, God. Yeah, actually, let's let's watch this intro because this is the most hype intro of all time. When I re-uploaded the first part to Bitshoot, you know, I watched the first like five minutes. Let's make sure the audio is fine. I think um, Bitshoot really does fuck up your audio. Bitshoot in general kind of sucks. Yeah, I should get into that today. But uh, man, this is like such a hype intro. This might be like the most hype intro of any game ever. It's up there with like Final Fantasy IX's intro, just cause like seeing that shit on the PlayStation blew my mind. But this shit is wild. It, it's worthy of being watched again.
<laughs> I like the idea of like I like the idea of Gamma just being like, now say goodnight! Gamma, no! Like, I mean, remember, 1998, guys. It's fucking nuts. Anyway, um... Yeah, Gamma's storyline, I feel like... Or is just gameplay style overall. I feel like... In theory, it's awesome. In execution, it's just, you know, you're just, like, holding the shoot button for a second, looking everywhere, releasing. Rinse, recycle, repeat. Select the fire. There we are. Yes, okay. There we are. So... Oh, God, my stomach... I did, at the end of yesterday's stream, because um, I was streaming Sega CD for a second time yesterday, it was a shit stream because, go figure, Comcast was doing unscheduled maintenance, and they don't send you emails for that shit. They just wait for you to start complaining about the internet, and they're like, oh yeah, there's scheduled maintenance today, oh uh, here, now that you are looking it up. Fucking assholes. Oh my god. Anyway. 55% done with Tails, 10% done with Sonic. We're gonna keep doing the, uh, you know, system we've been going, where we're doing the final one we unlocked until it's done, or we switch, or we unlock a new character. So, I guess we're back to Knuckles. When do we get big? Okay. I think you Let's only go. get big through either Sonic and Tails. Weird. Yeah, I like, I like Knuckles. Uh... Wait, he has the normal voice, yeah? I'm Knuckles the Enchidna. But some just call me Knuckles. I finally returned from a strange world. I am still missing some pieces. I saw a reflection of the egg carrier of the Master Emerald. Is it revealing the location of the missing fragments? If I follow Eggman's robot, it should lead me to the egg carrier. Let's go. <laughs> That's Knuckles the Echidna in accounting. He's in the cubicle right next to us. There we are. So we did unlock... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We like went this way. Saw the fucking robot. Man, his, his run cycle is so fucking weird. Yeah, I'm not gonna say this game is perfect. Far from it, but, uh, it, dude, it's not a bad game fucking at all. Really. Um, some parts are a little rough, but I was saying last time that that's what you get when you have a, uh, ensemble. Um, I think we already did that, yeah? Oh, no, no, he, he like, went this way and we we're supposed to follow him this way. Weird, interesting. But uh, honestly, like, it's kind of like with um. Oh shit! Thanks, Pickle. I appreciate it, man. How you doing today, bro? Woo. But um, yeah, that's what I was saying when I was like talking about uh Sonic CD and its jank yesterday. Is there is no perfect Sonic game. It is like a uh, I feel like a B tier franchise at best like at its best times but um no it's definitely got style though and uh, you're gonna have fun with the games definitely but <laughs> if you think there's like a perfect fucking sonic game oh fuck no although i do hear very very good things about uh sonic mania the new one that was released or the i guess kind of new one right what's that like 16 2016 Although that was, like, done as a 2D game, knowing full well the shortcomings of all the 2D games, with a wide resolution. Yeah, so I mean, am I, I guess I'm going this way, shit. Yeah, that's what blows my mind when people talk shit on the, uh, 3D games is, and don't get me wrong, like, uh, Sonic 06 is fucking a dumpster fire, to be sure. But, um, damn. And people are like, oh yeah, it's the same thing with Sock Adventure. It's like, what the fuck are you talking about, dude? Yeah. Eh, I feel just like to talk shit. Which I get it, I talk shit online too. Nice, some stealth seconds. <laughs> some stealth seconds. Hmm. Just what I thought. Time to make a house call. Big boss lands via his parachute right here. <laughs> Major Zero, I lost all my shit. Yeah, we should play that at some point. Metal Gear 3, Solid 3. 
Uh, Bickle says, doing all right. Just figured out that I lost my mod list of Skyrim. Oh, God. Nah, I've, um, that's happened to me. I mean, I've, you know, upgraded and switched computers many times. And yeah, that shit, uh, I feel like even if you keep your mod list synced, so I think even if you keep your mod list synced with the, like, mod DB or whatever the fuck it is, or, um, what's, no, what's the other one? Shit, what is that one? Uh, Vortex? Is that, is that what they're calling it now? Vortex Mod Manager? Um, even then, you still have to, like, order that shit and fucking install all of it and, I don't know. You're kind of fucking no matter what. Oh, damn. Yeah, what's going on? That's a good fucking question. The fuck is going on? Oh shit, I think this is the first time we're seeing this. Yeah, I don't think we saw this in uh, this Sonic or Tails. I think when we were playing as Amy and Knuckles, we were like below deck at this point, so we didn't get the uh, change. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mind fuck. Holy shit, this thing is fucking huge. God damn, I mean, I know you can't go that many fucking places, but still. The fuck? Fuck. Interesting. Can I go in this chair? Oh, come on. You can't, like... Okay, you're good. <laughs> nice. Oh, no, 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 please. You fucker. All right. All right. Oh, wait. Ah, I see. So you don't have to, like, stay. Oh, shit. What the fuck did I just do? <laughs> I'm just fucking ruining uh, Eggman's plans. Oh, that's how you go back. Well, we don't want that, right? We want it to be fucked up. <laughs> you think I'm like pissing off everyone on the ship? Like just fucking with them? All right, I guess I guess we go to here now. I don't know. I have no idea. I guess it's just like a safety net in case you want to go back. Weird. All right, um, I don't know, are we going this way? No, we can't go that way. Shit, we gotta go below deck. I think. Right? Maybe? Yeah, okay. We gotta figure this out. What do you have to say, fairy? Find the entrance to the sky deck. The master emerald is there. I guess it's right here? Ah, okay, okay, so it, it drains. <laughs> I like the jank. The jank is pretty great. How fucking rich is Eggface? All that metal must cost billions. Well, that's the thing, Pickle, is every time he... he like, in uh, Sonic 2, he created a fucking Death Star. And then it crashed in Sonic 3, and then he makes another one in Sonic 3. And, like, he, he makes this shit within, like, nanoseconds. I get that he makes robot helpers, but holy shit. Alright. Oh, it's already beeping. Already beeping and booping. Ah. Interesting. I'm hearing, <laughs> I'm hearing all sorts of like a very visceral sound effects. Oh god, sound effects are cancer. All right, it's very close. Oh, now we have the, like, the speed sound effect? Hey. Ah, shit. Fucking, like, tires and shit? Oh, wait, what is that? Come on, come on, fucker. There we go. Um, I might, like, switch this thing. Just so that way I don't have to be, uh, driven fucking insane. Tilt this shit upwards. Or just normal. There we go. This is a very loud game. Ah, that's beautiful. That's so much better. Oh, wait, no, no. Now shit's falling the opposite way. I just have it like normal. I feel like a normal tilt. Alright, let's uh, turn this shit. Come on, fucker. Oh, I am trying, Mr. Fairy. 
I am fucking trying, I promise you. Hey, there we are. I think that's good. I think we're good. Now nah, let's find the shit. No, we're still here in the splat sound effects. Wow. Man, this is a fucking loud level. No, I know the uh the gamma levels were also louder shit. Yeah, the um sound mixing you would think would be fixed in the mod. Apparently not. Ah, I see. All right, one more. Woo! Wow, and it's also nearby. All the shit's right nearby. Yeah, I think there's a couple of um, random places that it could be. It's like right here. It's like it's underneath us, I think, unless it's over us. No, it's, it's like right here. Come on. Oh, you fucker. Didn't think they could shoot electricity. One of these fuckers has it. Easier said than done. There we go. Oh, that's a fucking very quick level. Two minutes, 40 seconds. But yeah, I, uh, I wholeheartedly um, recommend the Japanese Sega CD soundtrack. It's, uh, it's fucking fantastic. <laughs> What'd you say, Knuckles? I can't quite hear you over the splat sound effects from 1990s Nickelodeon. It's like we're watching Figure It Out. I guess Figure It Out was more like 2000, yeah? Nah, I feel like that was like 97 too. It was around this time period. Oh, oh no. Not again. What is the meaning of this? Holy shit. Ah oh, shit, finally we're seeing the um, after these people com <laughs> committed war crimes on the chow. <laughs> Good. Good. Yes, burn them all. Before the flame god. Hey, what happened here? I couldn't stop them. They came, and, and my father. I had no idea how bad this would turn out. Pulled some Vlad the Impaler shit. I'm sure. <laughs> Shoved the chows, like, into wooden stakes ass foot first. Beautiful. Once again, I, I do like I, I admire the ambition of this game to try to tie in all of it's the more like a nightmare. Uh lore, <laughs> if you want to call it that, from Sonic 1, 2, 3, and C D. Oh god, oh damn. What the fuck? Your friends are in front of the ship fighting. Ah, I'm looking at where that is. Here are, I think we only have like one more fight as uh Knuckles and then we're done his storyline. Then we'll just burn through Tails' story I finally found until we get Big the Cat. Pieces, but I still can't yeah, I'm saving. I'm saving the best for the last. The uh, Sonic levels are the real meat of the game. Huh? I can appreciate all these bonus campaigns. <laughs> what was that, Knuckles? Here's some dick sucking noise. <laughs> Seamless. Seamless. Not again. I hate you. Hey Sonic. <laughs> Hello, Sonic. <laughs> there you are, Knuckles. <laughs> Thanks for the cheer, dude. Time. Knuckles gobbling up all that cock. Well it is Pride. It is Pride Month, right? I call it Sonic Month, but apparently uh, according to every company on planet Earth, it's Pride Month. Got to make them shekels. Now, I must return to Angel Island and the Master Emerald. Wow, so Knuckles didn't no, do shit. Oh wait, what? It can't be. So I gotta fight it again. I guess he didn't get enough the first time. Wow, Sonic's a lazy piece you of shit then. Me from restoring the Master Emerald. So this is chaos with six emeralds, which I mean I guess I'll say right now. All right, let's see what we're doing here. I think we're punching bombs. Oh shit! Oh, he just he fucking eats him of his own accord. I was about to say, 
I really don't have. Oh, I really hope I don't have to. Uh, fucking pick up and throw shit. Because the. Uh, oh damn, motherfucker! Gotta be all inclusive. And Knuckles being fisted up the asshole might be the answer. <laughs> it might as well be the theme. Oh, absolutely, man. Well, I gotta, I gotta celebrate Pride Month too. We all do. Otherwise, our overlords will beat us. What's it called in China? The People's Revolution? No, no, the Cultural Revolution. Yeah. There we go. I got gotcha. you. So explosions make him freeze. As you could expect from a uh, water god. Come on. Come on. Open up, buddy. Man, I think Zelda gonna sue somebody. This is some Dodongo shit. Oh shit! Speaking of Zelda, this is some fucking uh, Jabu Jabu stomach shit. Um, are you okay? No? Okay. I'd like to- I'd like to play through, um, Majora's, uh, fucking Ocarina Time at some point. I think I was saying when I was streaming for Christmas, my, uh, randomizer run of Link to the Pass. That... Yeah, I, I just played Ocarina of Time so fucking much that I've become, become kind of numb to it. Some games you have to just wait like a decade before revisiting. But it is a good game. I do I do really like Ocarina. Although if you like Ocarina and want to uh, get mad, ah! watch um watch This Is How You Don't Play Ocarina of Time by uh, Game Grumps. I swear to God, Aaron Hans is one of the worst goddamn things on the internet. I know, I know he has his fans, but holy shit, that guy is fucking cancer. I think he used to be good when he was teamed up with like Jontron. I feel like they balance him out, but uh, with uh, Danny, who just doesn't know shit about games and just agrees with everything, it just gives uh, Aaron full reign just to be Aaron Hansen. Once again, I, I make this comparison a lot, but it reminds me of, um... Well, when Dick Masterson and Maddox had their show. And, like, Maddox is a cunt, but I feel like... Being fucked with by Dick Masterson. I don't know, it kind of worked out, like it was a good dynamic. But some people, man. Holy shit. People need to be called out on their bullshit. I oh, speaking of which, I was gonna uh, talk about this earlier, but um, I was brought up uh, pro Jared and talking about gonna send dick pics for Pride Month to everyone on the Discord. Gonna pull some <laughs> pro Jared shit, but no, um, pro Jared though. Oh, okay, so they're frozen bots. They're freezy bots. Got it. But. Bro Jared and all of those YouTube game reviewers shows, you know, where they got the whole wall of video games. And they don't have a particularly offensive uh, comedy style. It's just kind of generally agreeable comedy. It's kind of like milk toast. They just go through the motions, maybe do like a couple obvious jokes. They mug for the camera. God. Anyway, like I was watching one of those. I was watching uh, Scott the Waz. That guy has like the ultimate soy face. I can't stand that content. I'm sure someone likes him. Don't get me wrong. I'm sure some some people like him. And if you like him, that's fine. But man, I can't stand that content. Anyway, was, yeah, uh, just because I was like very in, much in the mood to see some the mother opinions on uh, Sonic CD because I feel like I discovered something with that game and I really enjoyed it. I um you know saw that he had a fucking video on it, but man, he had some of the shittiest hot takes on that. And, like, it's okay to be critical. I was watching another guy named King K, who was also pretty critical of it. But he did, like, a good job talking about his critiques while also admiring, like, you know, pointing out the good things about the game. But nah, I don't know. Like, some of these just generic 
YouTube video game review channels. I just, I just don't get the appeal. They're so by the numbers. It's like they're going through the motions. Like I don't, I don't feel the passion of video games when I watch these assholes. I feel like they're just trying to uh, make a generally agreeable, generic YouTube video, get a million views, collect your paycheck. The Master Emerald and the Island have been restored. She always, she always a stand. Blows my mind. So anyway, yeah, I think that's uh, Knuckles' storyline. I think that's all of it. Which, you know, I, yeah, I like the old uh, hot and cold thing. Although, man, that we fucking flew through that shit. We fucking flew through that shit. There we are. So that was the uh, that was the second time Angel Island collapsed from the sky. You think it would be broken up by this point? By repeatedly smashing into the planet and causing tsunamis. Yeah, that, it, that's kind of why I thought that maybe this would be like a, this was a reboot game. Like kind of rebooting the whole story, but no, I think I think everything uh, in prior games did happen. It just kind of utilizes some of the same uh, I'll plot points. I'll probably be on this floating island forever. <laughs> yeah, I love these circuits. Guarding the Master Emerald again. Was it uh, Metroid Three? The last Metroid is in captivity. I may not know the whole story behind this. The galaxy is at peace. But perhaps it's better that way. I'm at peace once more. <laughs> yeah, God. <It's> awesome. <laughs> 10 out of 10. And cut. Oh shit, we get to listen to the Knuckles rap. Dude, the Knuckles rap is awesome. I don't chuckle. I just crack my knuckles. Rougher than the rest of them. The best of them. Tougher than leather. You can call me Knuckles. Unlike Sonic, I don't chuckle. I'd rather flex my muscles. I'm hard as nails. It ain't hard to tell. I break them down with Solid or frail. Unlike the rest, I'm independent since my first breath, first test, feel the right, then the worst left. Born on an Jesus, it's great. It's amazing. If you ever want to laugh, look up, uh, just look up Knuckles Rap. You'll find all sorts of remixes. Or like they replace every fucking noun with Knuckles. <laughs> like it's a fucking Madalib. It's like Dollar Tree DMX. <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Mom, can we buy this DMX CD? We got a DMX CD at home. DMX CD at home. <laughs> Knuckles gotta give it to you. <laughs> yeah, man. If you ever want to look up a uh, video of like a DMX concert pickle, or just or just like a fucking still image, look at the audience. All oh, white. It's awesome. <laughs> it's almost like skinheads. It's awesome. Beautiful, beautiful. But anyway, yeah, I'd actually recommend that uh, channel though, King K. Uh, it's like it's like a medium-sized channel. I think he has like a few ten thousand or maybe even a hundred thousand subscribers. I feel like I feel like it, it was around. Game's so bad, but that's what makes it so fun. Yeah, no, I agree, dude. Um. I mean, that's the thing is, I wouldn't really say it's the game, uh, this game is bad. I actually think Sonic Adventure is quite good. There's just a lot of cringe, but it's fun cringe. Yeah. <laughs> it's fun cringe, but but there are some parts that are legitimately bad. Um, I was talking about Amy, Amy's levels, which I like. I like the idea. Um, you know, Amy is slow as balls, unless she has momentum, but it gives you that uh, like high jump when you have momentum. And you're kind of like survival horror-y elements where you try to run away from a robot. 
but no, no, it just, something, something just doesn't click there. Gamma, I like the idea of like shooting everything, but it, it's fucking broken. I mean, you want to rewatch footage of me playing through that shit? Like everything just melts before you. But yeah, like uh, the, I like the knuckles. I don't chuckle. Um, <laughs> uh, the Sonic, the Sonic levels are legitimately really good. I um, actually don't mind the Tails, the Tails story. The main three are good. Big, uh, Big is. I remember Big being more rough when you don't understand how the fishing works, but when you get the fishing, it's not as bad, but still kind of bad. Let's see, Pickle says it's like playing through secondhand cringe. Oh yeah, absolutely. But yeah, this is this is in no way like. You just say the series is gonna get shelved. <laughs> you weren't you weren't wrong, <laughs> Dollar Store uh, DMX. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I take it from myself. This series gonna get shelved. Oh man, so Bickle says Adventure 2 is better music, lit, more interesting gameplay. Yeah, no, I, I hear really, really sincerely good things about Sonic Adventure 2. Um, yeah, I just never played it. I'm looking forward to playing it, though. I still say this is good, though. This is a fucking good game right here. Um, it's just some rough patches, but honestly, like, Amy's storyline is like 30 minutes. <laughs> it's like 30 to 40 minutes. Same with Gamma's. Same with Big the Cat. So, like, the bad parts aren't long, and they're all different. So, I mean, I think having the ensemble kind of works here. Select your but, um, yeah. So we're done. Gamma, Amy Knuckle. Wow, so only Sonic and Tails ever encounter the anomaly that is Big the Cat. Which, once again, is voiced by Duke Nukem. Dead serious. Yeah, I know, it's hard to believe... I don't know why. Like, anyone can do a retard voice. Hello, Froggy! See, there we are. I, I just did it. I just did a perfect Big the Cat. I'm Tails. We were so close to catching that Eggman. Happy Pride Month! But the tornado was shot down. I got separated from Sonic. I guess it's time to unveil my new invention. The robotic dildo. But first, I need a Chaos Emerald to get it to run. I'm off to find one! Uh, Pickle says Sonic's like a feral dog that obviously needs to be put down, but you can't bring yourself to it. Well, I, once again, I hear uh, Sonic Mania was good. It was just that time period of... What was it? Like, Sonic and the Secret Rings, uh, Unleashed, Black Knight, Sonic 06. Oh, <laughs> man, it's like, Sonic, please stop! Sega, rather. Oh, man. It was like, Sega was hell-bent. <laughs> on destroying the Sonic's legacy. Which, once again, I think, like, the older Sonics, they have their problems, man. They're not, like, amazing games. They're, they're good games with... <laughs> he is doing the O face. <laughs> that is the surprise Pikachu face, yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> That's good. Uh, I wouldn't have caught that. Um, shit. What was I saying? Yeah, yeah, the, um, the old Sonics, though. They're like, they're good games, but just not amazing games, you know what I mean? They're, uh, flawed. Mmm, wow, that dream brought back memories. For the first time Sonic I invaded so my foxhole. It was like I was back in Nam. Sonic! So what happened? Oh, um, we crashed our plane. Yeah, 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 yeah. We were doing the hmm. sky chase zone. Wonder where he went. Sure hope he's alright. The tornado's not powerful enough. If I'm going to get that egg carrier, I need to finish oh, my the pacing. prototype. The fucking <laughs> fortunate sunset plane. It needs a Chaos Emerald to work. I feel like I, I've seen something related to Vietnam like and I Sonic and Tails. I mean, people have done in everything with Sonic online somewhere with something. Oh, damn. Look at that breathing. It's like, no, I guess it's not so bad. So what am I doing? I'm uh, going to find something. Where is, uh... You must find the Chaos Emerald, but searching in the jungle is very difficult. I guess I'm going in the jungle, okay. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, am I going to, uh, am I going to Big's house? Am I going to unlock Big? Yeah, just started playing this fucking thing. I think Big's is over here. You kind of see, yeah, you can see the windmill over there. Fuck. No, I thought that was like a ladder. Interesting. Here we go. Oh, shit. I think, uh, maybe not. I remember running to Big somewhere. What the fuck do I do? Or maybe I go, in, like, into the... I don't know. Am I going to the secret base? Or am I going into the pyramid? Well, this shit's not built yet, so I guess we're going to the pyramid. Dude, you seen the Sonic movie? Uh, the new one? Um, yeah, the new one I didn't think was too bad. I thought it was actually pretty good. Which is scary. Because video game movies are supposed to be complete horseshit. Honestly, I thought the, uh, the Super Mario Brothers movie was, like, still to this day. I think there's fun to be had watching it. It's, uh, it's weird and fucked up and creative. <laughs> and I don't know why they made the decisions they made, but, uh, I thought that was a fun, uh, fun movie. So do I really have to go in here? Or no? I don't know. It said going into the jungle, so that would be here. I really have to scour the whole fucking, um, forest for this shit? But yeah, I, um, I thought the Sonic movie was fun, which, uh, is interesting because that, like, initial image of Sonic was so fucking horrifying. The one where you had, like, the jank demon dream Sonic. With, like, the small baby teeth and the beady eyes. Oh my god. I thought it was bad, but I do admit it was good for a game movie. Oh, it was a fucking great for a game movie. I wish we can get original Sonic movie cut. Where it, I, you know what, I was gonna say the same thing. I wanna see the, uh... Like, it has to exist somewhere. Cause it looked like from the previews that shit was done. Oh, alright. Do I go in here? I wonder if I have to scour this whole fucking thing. Um, let's see if we can... I, I vaguely recall... Something existing... By the, uh... By the ladder, I don't fucking know. I crave that cancer. Oh yeah, no, the, um... The OG... Well, OG. OG shitty Sonic was amazing. Honestly, if you look up a side-by-side, -side, and, um, I was making some new thumbnails for Sonic Mania and Sonic, uh, Spinball. Um, so I just saw it. If you look up a side-by-side -side between the final product and that original shit Sonic... Dude, I don't, I don't think people were overreacting with how fucking bad it is. It really was... ungodly. What am I looking for? Maybe I'm looking for the crash plane. Searching the jungle. Searching the jungle. Is the crash plane somewhere in here? Maybe it is. Huh. Well, hopefully we don't have to fucking look up a fucking guide. Holy shit. Oh, damn shit. All right. <laughs> there it is. Pickle says it was like looking in a goat seat of an eldritch abomination. It, it really was terrible. Like, it's crazy that they were surprised by the reaction online, but I'm glad that they actually listened to and changed that shit. Ah, oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Interesting? Oh, speaking of Goatsy. It's like looking into the unknown. Sand Hill subgame. I don't even fucking remember this. Holy shit. Hello, Akbar. Happy Pride Month. Oh. Oh. Woo. Oh, no, I missed some. No. No. I was doing so good. I was doing fucking perfect. Damn, I wanna- Damn, I wanna get up there! Fucker. Come on, come on. I wanna get up there. 
Don't deprive me of this. I want a perfect run. I don't even know why. I don't even know what these things do. Probably nothing, but still, I want them. Inexplicably. Well, there's a multiplier. Multiplier! I don't know why I said multiplier like that. Really emphasizing that I. Oh. 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 And the arms of an angel fly away. What is the point of this? Any points at the end? Probably get a uh, emblem actually. Playing slalom like this. Here we are. Once again, variety. Oh, I, I think I, I was watching a video just because, I don't know, I'm, I'm playing fucking Sonic all month, it's on my mind. L lay off me! But... I was watching a video on this game, and apparently the developing cycle was, I think, like, 8 to 10 months. It was less than a year. And they had, like, a completely different idea of what they wanted, and then they changed it. So that explains some of the jank, but... Honestly, considering how short of a dev cycle they had... For new tech. Very impressive. Seriously. Alright, now I think we get like the weird ass fucking Texan badge. Ah, oh, there we are. <laughs> yeah, it's like the Texas tie, you know what I mean? <laughs> what, what the fuck are those? Like, it's like a little rope tie that you see people like down south have. Or their fucking cowboy hat. Oh wait, what am I supposed to do? I think just that. I think that's all it does. <laughs> He's breakdance fighting. <laughs> it's like fucking uh, Zoolander. I feel like if I revisit Zoolander, that's gonna be a painful ass movie to uh to watch. Damn, you fucking really stay in the air, huh? But, uh, no, I, I can't believe, though, that uh, they made a sequel off Zoolander. I haven't seen it, but I'm, I'm can almost guarantee that's probably trash. Weren't we Hero's Tales earlier? I feel like we were. I think we're looking for Tikal, as we always are. And I think the only little bit of story we haven't seen yet is Sonic. Which is interesting. I mean, you can, you can put together the story at this point. Um... They're a neighboring group of people called the Chow. They worship the Chaos Emeralds with the uh, with the Water God Chaos held inside the main one, protecting them. Tikal meets them. They're very sweet, if obnoxious, and cancer. And then these people are like, holy shit, they have these infinite power gems. We must commit genocide, as one does. I mean, granted, you should commit genocide against the Chow, to be fair. They're pretty obnoxious. And... No? Really? <laughs> Sonic plowing tails up the asshole. I can't even stand on this. That's maddening. It looks it looks so flat at the top. I want to stand on it. Anything here? Really? Not that hard to believe. Oh god. Camera, work with me. Yeah, honestly, the camera in this game is not awful either. All things considered. The one problem with the Dreamcast overall was the, uh, the fucking controller, man. Which is weird, because Sega was so good with controllers for a while. Although, honestly, I'm not a big fan of the uh, Genesis D-pad, but I think the um, Saturn D-pad's a little bit better. I know they're, like, practically the same. I think there's a little bit of an ergonomic difference, though. I think it makes all the difference. The fuck? Yeah, we gotta find where this asshole is. What the fuck? Glad Libs I'm glad it lets me check that shit out, but be right at the front. Oh there she is, you bitch. The servers are the seven chaos emeralds. Hello there, friend. How are you? Hello there, friend. Come stay with for? us huh? forever and it's ever and ever. Oh yeah, my grandmother taught me a few things too. It goes like this. Like, uh, how not to rip the skin the by using someone else's chaos. mouth instead of your own hands. Chaos is power. Power enriched by the heart. The controller is the one that unifies the chaos. 
I feel like these people are probably like thousands of years old, Pinnacle. But the number seven. So I think. Oh, what the fuck? I don't even know what he's going on about. I think. I think Knuckles' whole thing is to like atone for the sins of his past people. Who his people were genocided against by chaos. For genociding the Chow. A lot of genocide in in, a, in your uh, in your Sonic game. <laughs> oh God, no! All right, now we have to play Big the Cat. Unfortunately. I'm sorry guys, I don't make the rules. I just enforce them. Here's John St. John, Duke Nukem. He just busted ass on his frog. <laughs> Remember, the plot makes zero sense without Big the Cat. Absolutely vital to the plot. This will get my tornado too up and ram to go. Should we play one more levels, Tails? Yeah, we'll play one more levels, Tails, honestly. We like we haven't done shit as Tails. We, like just switch to the it's story and haven't played jack that. shit. I guess we played the uh, sand minigame. Most of the problems. So here it goes. <laughs> I like Everyone the camera direction. And it show like the fucking windmill. Show the rocks in the background. Make sure it's like right up against his fucking face. Oh yeah, so this is what I was talking about last time, where he, he doesn't have landing gear on his plane, and it drives me apeshit. Where we're going, we don't need a landing gear. Ah, la, 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 la. Assalamu alaikum, motherfucker. Beautiful, beautiful. <laughs> Shalom. <laughs> Sonic, jump on! <laughs> he just gets like fucking eaten by the propeller. Cool plane, bro. <laughs> nice. He's got whatever shoes uh, the main character has in Just Cause. I like it. Oh no, <laughs> Sonic! No, <laughs> we're not gonna nail those guys. I know it's the Pride Month. But all the big companies, they want degeneracy. You're playing right to their plan. Yeah, we should still nail them, Tails. <laughs> you have violated United States airspace. <laughs> Lander be shot down. No, we're part of, uh, what's it, Operation Northwoods. They're cool with it. <laughs> Pro tip, don't look up Operation Northwoods. There's nothing to see there. Would the United States lie? Look at this shit. Why would you put mines all over the fucking sky? Yeah, uh, once again, um, what was it? Ah, uh, fuck, what was that game? Dragoon, Dragoon, something Dragoon. Like the Sonic IP. Oh damn, fucking eating that bullet. Oh, uh, what the fuck was it called? Something Dragoon. Adelish to Dragoon, not Legend Dragoon. What the fuck was the on rail shooters that Sonic made? Or a uh, second mid. Dragoon. I know people seem to really like it. But I keep forgetting it. <laughs> Woo! The 
fuck, dude? Not allowed to do that. Oh, shit. Fucking blowing me out of the sky, bro. I just Googled it. Oh, yeah, dude. No, uh, the CIA is fucking evil. Um, also look up MK Ultra. What's another thing you can look up? Um, Project Mockingbird. Project Mockingbirds. All this shit's been uh, declassified, too. So it's not like conspiracy either. <laughs> it's, oh, it's conspiracy up until the CIA declassifies it. They're like, oh, it was just a plan that we never fully utilized. You can trust us. <laughs> We're only using tax dollars <laughs> to fucking do some of the most heinous shit ever. Uh, God, I gotta love it. Oh, God. There we are. It's like, uh, what was it? Like hitting Dracula to guard the blood bank. <laughs> yeah. Gotta protect our freedoms. Alright, now we kill this thing. Oh! Oh, <laughs> god damn! <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. Didn't know uh, this one, MK Ultra. I know. Yeah, MK Ultra is kind of fucked. Um, honestly, uh, if you look up the story of Bobby Kennedy, Robert Kennedy, um, even Robert Kennedy's son thinks there's like some MK Ultra shit and uh, the shit that went down with his dad. What's that guy's name? Is the guy's name was like Sirhan Sirhan or some shit? But like, really fucking bizarre story. Weird shit. But, uh, strongly recommend it. Yeah, not a lot of people look into, um, Robert Kennedy. Uh, I guess... I just don't give a shit. I guess people don't look up Waco, either. <laughs> Although they really should. Yeah, uh, god damn it. Oh, so that's actually, like, part of the plot. Well, how do you fuck that up, Tails? <laughs> it's, like, perfectly designed. To completely sprit destroy its shit. Yeah, well, let's wow, land on the wings. This thing is really huge. Oh, come on, Sonic. You can't be saying that shit like that. No time to box, Sonic. We gotta <laughs> find Amy. Now let's just take those lines and put it in my Sonic uh, Rule 34. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Sorry for what? Without further added. interruption, let's celebrate and suck some dick. <laughs> Thanks, Knuckles. Knuckles, uh, fuck, what was it? Nichols Burridge? Shit, how you doing, dude? Hope you doing good. Hope you're having a happy Sonic month. This is the uh, 30 year anniversary, bro. We'll, uh, we'll switch to the Fix the Cat sooner here. I kind of want to save. Like, Sonic and Tails are the, the best shit in this game. <laughs> Sonic is so tired of his shit. I hate it when he doesn't listen to me. I guess you weren't expecting that, were you? There's only one way to get to me, Sonic. Why the fuck would we expect that? I doubt if you can make it. I dare you. Just watch me. Bring it on, Eggman. All right. All right. All right. That's good. It's good for now. Let's uh go to Big the Cat. The legend, the myth, the greatest corporate decision Sega has ever made. Select your character. No, Big Big the Cat doesn't have Jack and shit on uh, what Silver the Hedgehog. Oh wait, so how how far are we on that? Seventy percent, not bad. So seventy percent, ten percent, and then uh, zero percent. Big is a short one. Hold on, Froggy. I'm oh no, oh no. Why, why, why do they do this? Why the fuck did they do this? That is some fucking loud water. Man, they should have fixed up the sound mixing here. I know what it is about Japanese game devs and ports to the PC, but they always fuck up, like, controls, resolution, and sound mixing. You can, like, you can just bet on it. Vital to the plot. I'm doing good, Knuckles. Hope you're doing good too, man. Playing some classics. I grew up with this one on the uh, Dreamcast. 
And it's um it's nice to revisit it. Right now I have a mod in to make it more good <laughs> to fix some of this shit. Oh no. Why does he wear a belt? What the fuck does a belt do? Maybe carry some shit for him? Maybe. Jesus Christ. I mean, you do see the pot leaves all around, so uh, it makes sense. Yo, bro, you're looking weird. What's up with the tail? You have a stoner, mentally disabled, obese cat. Sonic would not be the same without it. But yeah, Duke Nukem. Why is this Duke Nukem's voice? I don't fucking know. But if you ever meet Big, uh, if you ever meet John St. John in real life. I'm sure people say like, yo, do, do the Duke Nukem voice. Instead, just throw him for a loop. Be like, hey man, I loved you as Big the Cat. And <laughs> do your Big the Cat voice. Got some Polywog Pals for you, buddy. Skeet right on your face. Oh god, I just got hit by a fucking car. <laughs> What oh, the fuck if this didn't happen? Eggman. Nice. Quick, we have to find the rest of the missing chaos emeralds. So just a way to remind you that this doesn't fact take place in the same time frame. All right, let's uh, let's try. That. Come on, dude. There we are. That voice gives Down syndrome. Oh yeah, it's it's incredible. It really is. They uh they were really proud of this. Lure power up. Use this to catch bigger fish. We don't even get like a voice either. No voice for you. So now we can catch shit. I don't know where we would do this. Maybe uh, maybe the pier. I don't fucking know. Nope. You think maybe? I don't know. Uh, the beach. I have no idea. Oh god. Oh god. Yeah, this is where all the jank comes out. It's right here. Right here. Yeah. Gotta have Big the Cat. Nope, that's locked. Okay. Where do I go now? I already went. Alright, that's locked. <laughs> all the like station attendants are like holding the door. Like, don't let him in. Please, for the love of god. I guess we can talk to the, the people. Wow, what a huge cat. Meow. Alright, so we got some weebs, so nice. Train station isn't open yet. The staff doesn't take time very seriously, as you can see. He's very calm. I know my reaction would be, OH MY GOD! <laughs> Pickle says, look at the size of that fat fuck. Gives me diabetes. Yeah, it's it's crazy. Staff only? Alright, I guess we're going this way then. We gotta figure out what we're doing and why we're doing it. Oh, wait, we can lift cars because we're a brick shit house. Yeah, okay. It's coming back. Doggy, there you are. I feel like I feel like Big the Cat story isn't... Well, story. The story's bad, but I mean, I think the uh, the campaign wait, isn't that bad. As long as you kind of understand how the fishing car. works, but I could be wrong on that. It could wrong. still be trash, but I remember it not being awful. Oh, damn. All right, you jump up here. Nope. Oh, come on, work with me, camera, please. Oh god, he does not take the slopes well at all. Should we have a maze? No, 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 we don't have a maze. Ooh, this is a claustrophobic camera. <laughs> Was that a joke about his tail getting caught in the door? Wait, what the fuck? Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, I remember. This is the uh, first one. He's a lot better in S Sonic Adventure 2. Okay, so he's in Sonic Adventure 2 as well. <laughs> Can I ride the Twinkle Circuit? Get my fat ass in the bumper car? 
Nice. So let's see if we can uh, finish up this one. I don't think there's only like four levels, right? Something very short. Um, alright, so we do this to move around. What the fuck? Uh, yeah, this is gonna take some, uh, take some effort. No! As intended. Okay, I guess, I guess this is a good time to figure out what we're doing. Alright, so you jerk around. The big bunny! Okay, gotta watch out for the, uh, for the pressure. Okay, oh. Come on, it's it's getting closer. Just like that Nine Inch Nails song, Closer. Just like that sign, Nine Inch Nails song, Closer. Okay, 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 all right, buddy. Come on. Oh. Uh. I'm trying to like figure this shit out. It's uh, it is a little bit weird. It takes a little bit to figure out, and they don't even really teach you too much. Just kind of like figure it out, motherfucker. Well, it's like any other fishing game, but it's still kind of kind of weird. Not sure, what I'm doing? I mean, I guess I'm doing. Oh god, you fucker! Oh, does that cost me a life? Holy shit! That cost me a life. Oh god, I don't even need the fish. All right. Well, I guess we'll see if we can uh, get some coins. Oh, maybe it, you lose coins. All right, just beat some monkeys to death with the fishing pole, which is a pretty awesome mental image. I gotta admit. <laughs> can I really do this? Oh wait. Hey! Am I the only one who wonders why there's a fucking red belly piranha in a fucking swimming pool? Well, there's also robot monkeys that throw explosives at you. There we are. So this might be like an Eggman theme park? Or, I don't know, I have no idea. So let's try to fucking do that. Nice. I mean, I could just like bash it up close and personal, but yeah, it's kind of fun. Kind of fun throwing your lure at it. And I guess that's all there's here. I wonder if there's anything in here. Some rings. Yeah, maybe you just lose the rings if you don't catch a fish. Seems kind of bizarre. <laughs> Can you imagine, like, going to the local lake. Someone just, like, they have a big-ass fish hooked. And then they, like, let it go. Like, they fuck up. So they just pull out a gun and kill themselves so right there on the spot. That's essentially what we just saw with uh, Big the Cat. It's a very problematic character. The Jar Jar Binks of Sonic Adventure, if you will. Alright, come on. Come on. Oh, come on. Okay, we gotta, like, let him... No, 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 no. No, 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 fuck off, dude. Oh, my God. What am I supposed to do there? Come on. Come on. Um, Froggy, please. Froggy, please. Ah, okay, so you don't reel in, you just find, kind of jerk it around a little bit. It's gotta jerk it. It's gotta jerk it a little bit. Come on. Come on, dude. Please. Oh, God. Please. No. Ah, oh, it's getting further away. Please. I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, Alright. I think I think I got the angle. You gotta, like, find out what direction to push the um, thumbstick in order to uh, catch it. It's kind of weird. All right, it's tired here. Just gotta be a little careful. Hey, there we go. Oh, We're kicking some ass. Wait, why is he sad? Did he fucking let it go already? 
Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't think I don't think he has anything to do with the plot either. I mean, they find the frog. Like who was it? Was it Amy who found the frog? I don't fucking know. No, no, it was uh, uh, Gamma. Gamma found the frog. It's not like he delivers the frog to Eggman. Oh my god. All right. Well, I think I think I kind of understand what I'm doing with this. I remember it always being a little bit jank. It's not awful. Like it's not awful. Well, I can't even say it's not awful. It's like uh, it just takes a lot of getting used to. A lot of fucking getting used to. All right. Now we take the stone. The train headed for the back over here. I swear it's only like four levels though. It's not long. Very short. Very short campaign. Anyway, what, uh, that fucking Scott the Waz video, I fucking, I, I don't, there's like zero appeal for Scott the Waz. Um, oh, alright. But, uh, no, I commented just because he, like, one of his complaints of Sega, C uh, Sonic CD. One of the co his complaints of Sonic CD was that... The colors are too vibrant and crazy, and the levels are too abstract. After he just pointed out that the game takes place on an alien planet. So I fucking, I commented that, I'm like, I pointed out, I'm like, uh, you know, I was, I was polite, I'm like, you know, you just talked about being an alien planet, dude. Like, it's going to be abstract and weird, and that's kind of the point, especially if you're traveling, like, back and forth in time by, like, thousands of years. But then within nanoseconds, I get someone who you commented back. Life belt. It keeps you afloat being like, well, it should still water. look like a real place. Like, yeah, yeah fucking real place on an alien planet. Like thousands of years removed? What the fuck even is a real place? I don't know. This is fucking weird. So, alright. So hold the jump button to stay down. Lift it to stay afloat. Got it. Cool. Not bad. I don't know, I just like, every time I comment on YouTube, I, I get like a fucking response within nanoseconds somewhere. It doesn't matter what video, and it's always by some of the biggest retards. It's like if you... Use the boulders to break the ice. God, how to, how to put it? It's like... Can I lift it, or do I just beat it? Wonder. Alright. Ah. Uh. Yeah, it's like if you ever disagree with the status quo on a YouTube video. It, I don't know how to put it. It's like these people think that YouTube comments are just for agreeing with the uh, person who's making the videos. I don't know, it's weird. It's just fucking weird. So what am I fucking doing with this thing? Um, I don't know. I guess we'll, uh, hit these bounce bats. And try to figure something out. Oh god. Oh god. Faster than the speed of fucking sound, bro. Can't believe it. He's so fast. The fuck is this? Oh my god. Oh my god. Maybe, maybe this is worse than Amy's. <laughs> maybe, maybe this is worse than Amy's. Maybe, maybe I misspoke. This is like, I don't know, there's something so like fucking goofy about this whole fucking thing. I mean, no shit, I feel like it's supposed to be, but... Oh god damn, what the fuck? I can't, I can't pick it up, motherfucker. Now this like was like the Incredible Hulk of Down Syndrome cats. <laughs> yeah, that's a fucking hell of a mental image right there. Hey, you guys, just jump on it. I am a boulder. Oh, sh uh, you just jump on it. Jesus Christ! Wait, didn't he just say something about a boulder? You fucking bitch. Hold up. Let's uh, let's revisit that thing. Oh God, I can't even get out. Please. Oh no, wait. I can just do that. Let's listen to you again. You fucking lying bitch. Use the boulders to break the ice. Use the boulders to break the fucking ice. Dude, you lying fucking slut. Oh my god. 
in the water um so like oh, there we are okay Jesus Christ all right where's froggy where are you fucking dickhead is there anyone on planet earth who's like trying to catch all the fish like yo this is the best thing ever yo oh he's I think he's lower Oh god, okay, yeah, got you gotta jerk it, not reel in. There we go. <laughs> nice, alright. I think we got it. Holy hell. That three and a half minutes felt like an eternity. Not too bad. Getting the speed shoes. Why do they put the speed shoes there? It's like a fucking practical joke. Seriously. We're gonna put speed shoes in. It'll make him run half a mile hour per hour faster. It'll be the funniest shit. Get John St. John to do his retard voice some more. John St. John is Forrest Gump. All right, come on, let's let's go, let's go. <laughs> it's bad. Yeah, this is this is definitely rough. This is <laughs> it's definitely a fucking rough patch. Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles is where the shit is, if you ask me. The shit in a good way. The shit in a bad way is everyone else. But I don't know. I guess the Gamma's not that bad. It just needed like some tweaking. It, Gamma needed a little bit more time in the oven. And Amy, they needed to do more with the whole, like, survival well, horror thing. I say survival horror, but I don't know what, like, what else to call it. You're running from a fucking monster. That you can't kill. Oh, God. I can't wait until we get the, uh... The song... At the end credits, it's like kind of your reward is hearing how. Oh my god, look at fucking. Oh no. Oh no. My daddy taught me to hold on tighter. <laughs> oh no. I guess I'm going back to Station Square. What's the next level? I can't even remember. I also, I remember those two. Um. What would the next level be? Oh, the beach? Probably the beach. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because that's where um, Gamma finds the frog. Yeah, that's probably where we're supposed to go. Oh my god, look how slow he moves. <laughs> oh, man! This is your punishment, dude, I swear. Go to Station Square. Yeah. You may find something. Oh, fucking kills the stairs, though. Holy shit. Oof. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> oh no. All good. We're getting we're getting progress. That's the important part. Oh shit, what up? I better go after Amy. So is this when he goes to Station Square? I guess so. Alright. We're gonna get through these vegetables so we get to the meat. Yeah, like I was saying, it's probably gonna be a four stream affair total. This is the third stream right here. Probably be able to finish like Biggs and Tails today, honestly. We don't have a whole lot of left of Tails. Or are we at like 70%? And this one, honestly, I, I think we're already 50% through. I think there's only four levels. Uh, the beach is this way. Yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, they, they they knew they were onto something here. <laughs> oh god, it's a murder of the monkey. Yeah, I would spend more time with the Chow Garden, but like, I, I'm really not a fan of the Chow Garden. I, I know I'm like, I'm sure you can get into it. You know what I mean? 
and I don't want to necessarily like gimp the playthrough by uh, ignoring some of the elements that you know people seem to like. Oh, I got you, Biggle. There's a secret passage somewhere. Go and find it. There's a secret passage somewhere. What the fuck are you talking about? I mean, I guess it's part of Sonic, you know, exploration, having fun. So we'll uh, we'll explore it a little bit. Let's find the secret passage. What does that even mean? Oh, I guess so on the uh, the end of the. The thing. Sit. Secret passage. Oh, maybe like underwater. Maybe that's what they mean. Ah, that's what they mean. Un yeah, okay, okay, makes sense. I guess you can breathe underwater, huh? Interesting. Holy shit. Fucking robo fish. I mean, do we need the coins? Not really, but once again, I as well enjoy our time. Try to find a. Try and find the peanut in this piece of shit. Maybe get 100 coins. <laughs> I will just keep calling them coins. Call them coins till I fucking die. Yeah, I guess I guess you get coins by uh, catching fish. Once again, I'm not saying there's like much of a purpose, but if you want some more gameplay, maybe maybe you really dig the fishing here. But uh, Dreamcast had a fishing game, like Sega Bass Fishing or some shit. I'm not sure if it was good or not, but I, I don't really play fishing games. One of those like super niche genres. <laughs> I'm sure there's like one or two super hardcore fans of. All right, so uh, let's let's go. Let's go on with it. Man, this motherfucker's slow. I guess it's good to find the frog before we actually start fishing. I think he is uh, just at the end of the uh, the little peninsula. That's what you want to call it. I think that's what we'll call it. You would think the robot fish would hurt you. No, like it's a chill game. Once again, it's you know not a long game. It's something you could beat in a weekend. But uh, there we are. There's that little fucker. And we will stop at 92 coins. Drive some people crazy. No, 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 the other way, fucker. No, 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 oh, no. There we go. Oh, come on. Ah, you dick. There we are. I think they make the frog intentionally easier to fucking catch than everything else. Because <laughs> they know some people will not give a fuck about this. Which, I mean, I can appreciate. Beautiful. I think there's just one more, and I think that last one, where would that last one be? On the, uh, the airship. What the fuck, the uh, egg carrier? Uh -oh. Yeah, it's the egg carrier and then the boss. And yes, there is an end boss. No. Come, <laughs> Come back, please. I mean, the end boss is kind of clever, relatively speaking. I mean, I could just give it away. Fuck it. I don't think anyone gives a shit. So, it's like you have to catch the frog inside of chaos. Which, I mean, is like a giant amorphous blob of water. I mean, I don't know. It kind of makes sense. Yeah, we could easily finish this one and then uh, finish Tails today. Sorry. Maybe even do a Sonic level. This place doesn't look familiar to me at all. 
And I think we might do like Sonic Spinball tomorrow, maybe. Ah, oh, <laughs> uh, you're smelling Eggman's girlfriend's pussy. Do you think Eggman fucks? I mean, I know he has like really weird proportions. But I mean, shit. If you carry yourself right, I think even if you look like Eggman, <laughs> you can pick some bitches up. <laughs> shit. All right. Uh, now this is the shower garden. What am I? What am I even doing? Go into the hot shelter. Oh, where's the? Is there a berry around? No? Fuck me. Fuck me sideways. Your friend is in the hot shelter. Yeah. Hurry up and rescue him. So hot. What a weird naming choice, hot shelter. I'm sure it's translated one to one from Japanese. Sometimes the Japanese don't know what the fuck they're talking about. Because, you know, they just... Have you ever talked to a Japanese person? Of like, you know, like, hey, wh why, why is there so many, like, shirts in English and, you know, people will name shit in English. Uh, they just think it, it's cool. It's kind of the same reason why people like, uh, I don't know, Japanese or Chinese style tattoos or some shit. Just, you know, it's exotic, it's weird, it's foreign. Nice. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Oh, no! Wow. That sucks. This is like a proper level, kind of. I'm sure we'll see it right in this next uh, this next room. I think we fill this with the water, and then he's right there. So let's grab the uh, rings first. God, he's so slow. Oh, what the fuck? How weird, a cutscene in the middle of a level, huh? Oh my god. Nice way to cue the <laughs> way to cue the guitars right with the uh discovery of the fucking frog. Alright, let's um get a one up. I bet we'll need a one up, but I don't know, maybe we will on the end boss. I don't fucking know. I don't think it'll be that rough. Where's the frog? Where's that little rat bastard? Right there. And we gotta stand out of the water, apparently. Sometimes it lets you stand in it, sometimes not. Oh, come on, you little fucker. Oh, come on. It's like, it's like reverse. It's really weird. Something's biting! Come on, come on, please. You gotta find the sweet spot with the joystick. You're supposed to like push it in the direction of where Big the Cat is? But with the camera jerking around all crazy like, it's just, it's kinda weird. It's kinda weird. Alright, alright dickhead, come on. Come on you fucking bastard frog. <laughs> I think it just gets tired. I think it just gives it to you. I really do think so. I think they did that shit in, in, uh, intentionally. Beautiful. Beautiful. Now for the end boss. Yeah, that, that, that's, that's Big the Cat's campaign. Not too bad. I guess it can take a while if you don't know where to go, but I mean, just go to the fairies. They'll, they'll tell yeah. you. We're together again at last, huh? Oh, God. Huh? That's strange. Oh, no. Is it really imperative that he gets... <laughs> he probably has, like, the darkest future yet. Wow, everything's on fire! Yeah, I smell dead right bodies! On. Froggy? Wow, Knuckles' people are making the Holocaust look like a field day. God, I, w I really do wish you get to see the genocide of the Chows in Big's flash forward, or flashback, I should say. I, I like the idea of the water god, you know what I mean? Like. 
The idea of explaining some lore behind the uh, Chaos Emeralds, because they're just kind of a thing in earlier Sonic games. Because <laughs> in Sonic 1, there's only six, and they're just there as like a little bonus to get. There's only six stages, so there's like one per level, theoretically. The servers are the seven Chaos Emeralds unified by one. That is the controller. But then someone at Sega was watching Dragon Ball Z and they were the like, holy Chaos. shit. Super Saiyans are cool as fuck. Let's add one more Chaos Emerald <laughs> and make Super Sonic. But no, they do that shit a lot. It's like um, Silver to the Hedgehog and Sonic 06 is supposed to be like Trunks. You know, from the future to fix the future. Doesn't quite make sense, but eh. I don't know. As a fan of Dragon Ball Z, I can't I throw like too much shade. Of this place. It's not like they try to hide the uh, <laughs> the ripping off of ideas. If something happens now, there's no point to my rescuing you. I don't know who would bother to save us both. All right, we come on. Get going, <laughs> you know, the pacing, the pacing of these cutscenes are dog shit, dude. They really are. It's like, just these long pauses between pretty much everything. All right, let's see uh, see what we're doing. Do we want to get out of the ship or do we just want to go up? No, we just want to go up, right? Oh, no, 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 we, uh, we have Froggy. The first time ever. Cool. <laughs> this is just glitch out for me. Thank you. I appreciate it. And then what? That is the important question. Now we fight chaos. Yeah. Oh god. Really? With your fucking fat ass? God damn it. God damn it. Oh wait, that one. Yeah, she's the right one, I guess. Or maybe we were hitting the ceiling? I don't fucking know. It's a very jank experience. Raggy, no! Like, uh, <laughs> was it the Grapes of Wrath? Tell me about the frog, Sonic! <laughs> Sonic just puts like a fucking loaded 45 against his head. <laughs> Sheds a single tear. Grab him! Get that frog! And don't forget the chaos emerald! It was the grapes of wrath, right? Like I'm not fucking confused on that one, yeah? Now, what an interesting thing for um like Looney Tunes to rip off so much, or or to like reference so much rather. <laughs> <laughs> like looking at the Graves of Wrath and just be like, yo, let's make jokes about this execution of a retard in order to cover up his crime so that way he doesn't go to court. Right. That is the plot of it, right? Yeah, like I read it like once years, years ago. John Steinbeck, short book. I think I remember it. I never got the tail thing though. Like, what if he got all seven Chaos Emeralds, but no tail? Would he not be complete? Alright, let's do this shit. I think, I think you just throw the hook into the mouth. I think that's legit all you do. It pretty much just gives it to you. Oh my god. Uh, Jesus. Gotta go! Froggy? I'll save you! Don't worry, Pally! So, he's your friend, eh? <laughs> no sweat! I'll help you out! Get him back! Watch me! It's kinda what I do! I save wildlife! Careful, Froggy! Don't what what worry. was that fucking camera? Oh my god! I, I get that it's like new tech, but man, some of this camera is like insane. What other game had like really 
really weird camera direction. I mean, I'm sure a lot of them, but... Aim for the frog and cast Take the lure. Come on. There we are. We win. That's our end boss. <laughs> like, like, no shit. For real. That's all it is. 13 seconds. Hooray! Soggy! <laughs> Final Fantasy X. Final Fantasy X is the game with a really weird camera direction. I actually really like Final Fantasy X. It's not like my favorite, but uh, if you actually get into it and just talk to everyone in the game multiple times to get all the lore, it's actually a pretty good story, sincerely. Um, really, my problem with X is just the pacing. The pacing fucking kills that game. Spirit Grid also kind of sucks dick, some of the ideas behind it. I think I've been thinking about doing a uh, Final Fantasy like ranking video for a while now. Huh? I'm gonna steal this fucking what? plane. Hey, no fucking landing gear. How do we even how do we even get into position to take off? Oh well, I'll give it a try anyway. Unless he like throws it off the fucking ship and then jumps into it, which would admittedly be pretty badass. <laughs> There's something really fucking weird about that. Ugh. Oh god. Oh, we get to we get to enjoy the end credit music with this dude singing about hanging out with cats and frogs. Beautiful lyrics. Gotta get ready. Our body is ready for it. <laughs> it just shatters his fucking knees. All the cartilage gone. Froggy, no! I'm gonna need to be put down! <laughs> Fucking zero relevance! <laughs> zero! Like, Amy had zero relevance to the plot. This is like next level. Oh god, no. <laughs> I am your new god! I demand sacrifice victims. Bring my enemies before me. Oh god. <laughs> oh man. That's the fucked up thing is in order to see Supersonic, I mean I know these like campaigns are like 20 to 40 minutes a piece. Very bite size. You know, except like Tails. Like the bad ones are like 20 to 40 minutes a piece. So in order to like see the actual ending of the Supersonic ending. Gotta play through this. Which it's not god awful, to be honest. It's just kind of busy work. But like you know, you could fish. You could fish all of the fish in the pond. Your reward would be coins. Maybe an extra life. Why would you need an extra life as this character? I don't know. <laughs> so there's like really no point. Um, if you're that into fishing, you would have the uh. Oh no. It's like amazingly cringe. Like, cringe is an overword, overused word, you know? But, like, my face is legit contorted right now. Talking about the Contra code? What the fuck? Oh jeez. <laughs> I 
completely like flatlined my train of thought. <laughs> the fuck was I saying? I don't even know. But yeah, you have to play through all this shit in order to play the Super Sonic ending, which I think is worth it in the end. But it's like, ah, damn. Oh yeah, just the pointlessness of the fishing is what I was saying. Yeah, there's really nothing. If you're that into fishing, you would just play, uh, like, Sega Bass Fishing or whatever it's called. Sega Bass Fishing. Gotta get some orchestral instruments. It's like the credits are extra long for this one. I guess it's not as jarring as the... It's definitely more cringe, but it's not as jarring as Amy's ending. Where the song is about shaving your pussy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what it was. <laughs> I'm not even fucking joking. Unless she's talking about shaving her legs, which I don't know, I don't know man. And what is a pussy, if not an extension of the legs? Oof. Yeah, there's your, there's your beautiful title card. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, far, far from a perfect game. Like, don't, don't get me wrong. There's, there's a lot of cringe. Although some of it's love, love, <laughs> lovingly cringe, I should say. But um, yeah, some, some real rough patches in this one. But that said, Sega. it still blows my mind that some people compare this one to 06. Sonic 06 is fundamentally broken. Every single aspect of that game. Um, really is a sight to behold. And honestly, I kind of recommend watching like a play at least maybe not a full playthrough i mean you can if you want <laughs> fucking do whatever you want but uh i do recommend watching at least some f imagery of sonic 06 it really is amazing i think uh avgn has a video on it i think maybe multiple videos i'm not sure i'm not sure if he ever got past uh, the beach though maybe he did an extra one okay so we're done the three shit characters one of the good characters and we got uh got two more left so we're gonna finish up with tails who are we doing uh we're going to the hot shelter which i actually remember is kind of a rough race between him and sonic i remember this one actually being tricky hi i'm tails wow cool this flying fortress just transformed just like me i'm transforming right now but now it's not the time to admire Eggman's technology. He has just challenged us to clear the sky deck. Okay, let's go for it, Sonic. Amy awaits us. Once again, happy Pride Month, everyone. <laughs> oh, God. Holy shit, I fucking got launched by that shit. Look for the entrance to the sky. All right. Let's see, probably right here. So, this must be the sky deck, huh? <laughs> nice, that was easy. Uh, that, that's, what the fuck was the point of that cutscene? Alright. I know why we had to beat Sonic to this fucking capsule. Let's get going. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you, Sonic. I'm gonna fucking cheat like a motherfucker. Hey, 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 I forgot! Oh god, why is that so fucking funny to me? It really is though. Hey, hey, hey! What's going on, Tails? Oh shit! Ah, oh, Tails, you're killing me! Holy shit. Dude, I lost all momentum with that jump. Oh, 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 okay. God damn. There's probably better way to do that. See you later, Tails. Oh wait, shit. No, no, this is the right way. 
You can see our uh, progress. Yeah, just like fucking cheat, dude. <laughs> what do you, you play that this one? Just fucking cheat. I mean, it's kind of made for you to cheat. Be fucking sure. Um. Here we are. Jesus. Yeah, I remember this one being tricky. I don't know why my child brain was like, no, let's go through the route. <laughs> let's go through the route proper. <laughs> now I'm like, no, I can fly. I can just like <laughs> level break this like a motherfucker. Is Sonic okay? I feel like Sonic's not okay. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> so what's wrong, Sonic? Oh, jeez. Yeah, I don't know. Sales is kind of interesting. It's all about breaking the yeah. fucking levels. Is that it? Sonic, we should check out the bridge. Wasn't that kind of like what you did in Sonic 3? Once again, it's been a while since I played Sonic 3. I remember my problem with Sonic 3, for anyone uh, for anyone curious. Once again, a happy Pride Month. <laughs> but uh, for anyone curious, my problem with Sonic 3 was that... Um, no, what the fuck? Ah, uh, the, the levels were just so massive and maze-like. What, what level fucked me up? I'm trying to remember. Like, the Marble Garden, like, real early on. I just think that level is fucking horseshit. I heard, I because I was watching some videos on it, I heard that that's apparently, like, the worst level. Or one of the worst levels. Just kind of like a rough patch, but if you can get past that, apparently people really like it. You're a bit late. Although well, some people overhype Sonic 3 and Knuckles, so I'll kind of keep my uh, expectations hedged when I play through that again. But I do want to like do a legit playthrough through that, because I, I, it's one of the few Sonic games I never beat and never even got that far into. I do like how that's a save feature. Alright, now I gotta beat the shit out of Gamma. Nice. Well, that motherfucker's packing. There's a really old video. I don't know why this is fucking in my head right now, but there's a really old video. It had to have been from like 2004, 2005, 2006, sometimes around there. It's a really old video. About a chick who's. It was a hood chick. It was a hood chick who's like... Wow, it's so fucking easy. A chick was like shot in the head with a fucking gun. And her weave stopped the bullet. And she was like showing off like, Yeah, so you can see the bullet right in my weave. <laughs> it's like, it's fucking crazy. How fucking nappy must your weave be? <laughs> to be fucking bulletproof. <laughs> I, I don't know, just look up look up weave bullet. I don't know, I'm, I'm sure you can find it with just that. Hey, this ship is losing altitude. Hurry, Tails, take Amy and get out of here. Well, what about you? I'll find Eggman and put a stop to his evil ways. So what, what's Tails' end boss? Nice. Nice animations. Why, why does her fucking skirt have to be like completely inverted? What, what is wrong? <laughs> what is wrong with the Japanese? Please. Yeah, it's a nice, nice panty shot. Yeah, it's fucking great. God, between like Sonic the Hedgehog, Space Jam, what else, what else caused furries to be a thing? There's some very, very exact things we can point our finger at and blame. Man, what a fucked up generation millennials are, seriously. Tactical hand. What happens when you get raised by hippies, shit? It takes a degenerate to raise a degenerate. Wow, what the fuck was that? <laughs> it's like... 
God, what was that old Nickelodeon show where they ran through uh, uh, Double Dare? It's like a mix between Double Dare and Al Qaeda. Eggman. I wonder what happened to Sonic. Fucking great line read, bro. I wonder what happened to Sonic. I hope he's not dead. I'm finished. Chaos was defeated, and now my egg carrier is ruined. No matter. I will destroy Station Square anyway. So my question is, when it came, comes to voices around this era, how did Star Fox 64 do it so right? And same with uh, Metal Gear Solid. Metal Gear Solid and Star Fox 64. How the fuck did they do it so right? Speaking of which, technically, didn't this game come out? Yeah, this game came out the same year as Metal Gear Solid 1. Fucking crazy. Once again, the Dreamcast is a very impressive uh, console. That missile is launched. <laughs> is, he, is he on a nuke the fucking city? We will make Akira reality. Welcome to Neo Tokyo. Dan Goku Natenshi no Yoni. Tails has caused the third impact. Oh god. What the fuck is the point of this? What the fuck is the what is the point of that? Oh, I got a race. Okay, got it, got it. Oh no! I better get to that missile. Eggman really has gone full of Lau Akbar. That's awesome. Inshallah, motherfucker! I see it! I will offer you a free warranty on your car! Square depends on me. Oh, Sonic. All right, let's, let's fucking do this shit. Come on, please, please. Why are these faces slow? Since I started hanging with Sonic. You could but say I've been transitioning. I know I can do this by myself. Okay, Eggman, bring oh, it on. Oh, please, just let me play. <laughs> just let me play. Why are these faces slowly? It really is amazing. All right, it's a cool idea, though. You think you can keep up with <laughs> it's me? It's fucking crazy. Goodbye, the infidel will all pay. And we are going to do our thing of fucking cheating. Oh my god. Because that's what Tails does, bro. Fucking cheats. Yeah, a little, little bit of a jank camera. This level is fucking awesome, by the way, if you're playing the Sonic. Oh shit. Ah, there we are. Probably one of the best levels in the game. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to the uh, the Sonic campaign, honestly. It's, um, yeah, it's just good. It's the works. Alright, interesting. Not really sure where I'm going, just follow the rings. And you're golden. Although I will say that the, uh. Alright. Just take the rocket. I will say that the, um, the little status bar to the bottom of the screen actually does really help a lot. And, like, run on the ceiling if you get it just right. I fucking can't. I could imagine what it would be like if I could, right? Get a checkpoint, just in case. You never fucking know. There we go, beautiful. And I just okay, cool. It's interesting in lieu of a uh, of a boss fight. I mean, I guess there probably still is a boss fight, but in, in lieu of that, you get something built on the whole idea of racing. I don't mind it. I think it's pretty cool. Once again, I don't think Tails' story is bad at all. Tails, oh, Knuckles, man. Sonic. That's where the shit is. So you beat me to the missile, you little bust. <laughs> I gotta dress like they're from the 40s. I will make you all pay for this. Like we're on the set of Guys and Dolls. Interesting. 
Interesting. I remember you this boss fight. Away before I make mincemeat out of you. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. Not sure if that voice is good or bad. I can do this. You hear that? I'm not afraid anymore. <laughs> oh shit, it gave me a free ring. Actually, I appreciate that. Oh, fucker! Um, alright. Shit. Already hitting him. Oh, come on. I'm trying to get away. Oh, you have to hit the one that's uh, glowy. Ah, I got it, got it, got it. Hit the glowy one. He jumps. Got it. So how do you do, like, a spin dash? Like... Ah, and then you do that. Got it. Oh, you fucker. Hmm. I guess it's kind of late to be trying to figure out how to do a uh, spin dash. Ah, okay. Just hold, hold the attack. It's probably easier to do a Sonic. Oh god damn it, you little fucker. Yeah, interesting robot. I think this is one of the more interesting boss fights in the game, honestly. Oh come on! What the fuck? Did I hit it? I guess so. Oh shit, damn. Going full Vietnam on my ass. Nice, beautiful. Hey, not bad. We got it, we got it. Yeah, and honestly, we could probably do like a one stage of Sonic. We're calling it. I'll save like the rest of the entire campaign for uh for next time. <laughs> Sonic Adventure was filmed before a live studio audience. <laughs> now they're just fucking gone. There's just like a boom box in the corner. Tails, you did it. I don't know what the fuck you did, but I'm sure you did it. This guy's for a celebration. So without further ado, let's celebrate and suck some dick. Shit, he's singing the lyrics. Why is his mouth changing? It really is the surprise Pikachu voice. <laughs> he's fucking singing it! What the f- <laughs> Why is he lip syncing the fucking lyrics? Nice. Now we get to hear the uh, intro right before the chorus once again. I love, I love the direction. I will say, in terms of like bad music for Sonic, once again, Sonic 06, man. All hail Shadow. Still makes me fucking laugh. Although some people legitimately really like that zebra head. Uh, what the fuck was it? What the fuck was it? Ah, I got a posture check. I got you. Thanks for the heads up. No, my posture really is dog shit. <laughs> like sincerely. But no, some people really do like the uh, the zebra head um, in his world. But uh, I uh, think it's a little bit too cringe for my taste. Yeah, I like this one. The um, the open up your heart. It's gonna be alright. That shit's fun. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> if I inhale water. You better believe it's gonna be on stream. <laughs> Hold up, I'm gonna mute myself. Oh, 
Like all the dudes named Abe in Japan. It's a good name. My name is Sumu Yoshi Abraham. Oh uh, man. So yeah, we'll probably play one level of Sonic and call it, and then next time we stream this, we'll uh, finish it up. And I'll see what I, how I feel. We'll either do Sonic Spinball tomorrow, or we'll finish this one up. I'm thinking one of those two. And then I think we'll start on... I guess Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Yeah, I guess we'll just start on that one. So once again, we're going to be doing Sonic games all fucking month. And I've never completed Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I've never even played Sonic Adventure 2. Once again, I grew up with this one. And what the hell are we gonna do? Oh, Shadow, Shadow the Hedgehog. I got the uh, I got the uh, GameCube uh, emulator up and running. That should be fun. <laughs> oh man, Shadow the Hedgehog. What if we combine Sonic with GTA 4? Are you sure that's a good idea? Shut the fuck up, pussy. We're doing it. People won't be laughing at us. I promise. I guess that's about it, right? Yeah. And we'll do a single stream right on the anniversary date, which I think is like the 24th. We'll play through Sock 1, which I don't think is an amazing game. Like, it's... You know, Emerald Hill is great, or uh, Green Hill Zone, rather. But man, like, the Labyrinth Zone? Oof. Oof. Sonic 1 can get pretty rough. But I can I can beat that one in one sitting, though. We'll play through that. That'll be a one stream off. Uh, Sonic Spinball will be a one stream off. Um, yeah, really the only things that I'm not sure how long it'll take us is... Uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles, Sonic Adventure 2, Shadow the Hedgehog, and um, Sonic Mania, which I did make a uh, make a thumbnail for today. So we'll be looking forward to that. Anyway, let's dive into the next one. So that just leaves Sonic, shit. Good, we saved the best for last. Did that shit intentionally, because I don't like... I don't like playing through all of Sonic... And then, before I play Super Sonic, having to go through all these campaigns. I'd rather just save, save the best for last. Alright, let's do the shit. I'm Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog. I ran across the Emerald Coast and found Tails, whom I haven't seen for a while. He had a great idea about creating something using a Chaos Emerald. He just loves making machines. What? He has a workshop in Mystic Ruins. Okay, I'll go visit if you want me to. Awesome Sonic voice, 10 out of 10. Hire me, Sega. <laughs> Give me that Tendi money. Hey, baby. <laughs> I feel great. There's nothing like swimming pools in the ocean in the summer. Uh, let's see, what are we doing? Um, now we can't do this one yet. We need the light dash for that. You can't do the casino. I think we're just running to where the plane is. I think that's all. Right? I don't think anything else. Yeah, because the popo -po still blocking our way. Assholes. Let's uh, go right into the station. I got feel See, it's just like the game was designed around Sonic. You know what I mean? It just feels good to be fast in this game. Honestly, the control's pretty fucking good. It's again, people equating Adventure to uh, Sonic 06 are just morons. I mean, sincerely, I, I mean that wholeheartedly. <laughs> like, opinions, everyone's got them, I got it, but like... Sincerely. I mean, the only person I've really heard be that much of a cunt is uh, Aaron Hansen. Workshop should be around here somewhere. But no, it's um... Okay. 
<laughs> if it isn't Sonic. So now it's a false equivalency. Although yeah, I have, I've heard mixed things about what was it Sonic Heroes? Some people seem to like it. Some people seem to hate it. They'll have to. Uh, I don't know, maybe we'll check out that one day. I'm not really interested though. I'm not like a die-hard fan of the series. I'm a fan enough to play through some of these games, but not like play every single fucking one. <laughs> Shit! Oh my god, it's so fucking loud and sound mixing. All right. All right. I, I, yeah, I see it. I see it, bro. Oh boy. I cut that shit together a little bit better. Here, grab a ring. That's all you need. Yeah, it just feels good. It just feels good to play with Sonic. I don't know. They did a good job with this one. So, I don't understand, though, how, like, if they understood how to uh, make Sonic in 3D. How do they fuck up Sonic 06 so badly? I, I, it really doesn't make sense. Oh, God. Like, this feels good. I mean, you know, you can control it. <laughs> Yeah, I'll have to uh, double check that um, AVGN video. I, I I feel like he only played the uh, first level. Maybe maybe he played a whole bunch more. Damn, he builds fucking speed quick. Holy shit! <laughs> God damn! Can't even fucking keep up. Beautiful, beautiful. All right. And once again, my, my thoughts on Sonic 2 is that it's a good game. I like Sonic 2 more than Sonic 1. I, I streamed that one a uh, maybe a few well, months ago. That wasn't so hard. It's just very long. And that uh, that no. ending, was it uh, Metropolis? Right, it's like three different acts. That, all that sucks cock. And then fighting Metal Sonic, Chaos. followed, or Mecha Sonic, followed by the weird fucking janky hitboxes of the Death Egg robot. Man, what a shitty fucking way to end the game. Especially with limited contr continues. It's like the idea of losing to that like trial and error bullshit only to play through the whole game again. Man, that game needs a save state or a save file. So what does he like want though? Like he just he just wants power, right? Cause like he, he clearly has all the money. And probably kick ass lab. Probably just make like a fly bitch robot. And then just be a degenerate and fuck ro love robots all day. I don't see why I need to do this shit. Um, all right, are we good? Where are we done? Oh shit! <laughs> Whoa, let's uh, let's be a little bit careful there. All right. Yeah, so just like old school Sonic, um, going into a spin dash and then jumping on a ramp will just it'll just fucking launch your ass. No, wait, I'm going the wrong way. Jesus. Uh, this way. Beautiful, beautiful. No, we'll play, we'll play like a couple levels. I just don't want it to be so that way, like, 
I underestimate how long this campaign is, and the next time I stream this game, we're going for like three hours straight. I really don't think that'll be the case. We'll play for a little bit longer, though. This is a fun game. <laughs> Once again, it's just some of the campaigns suck, that's all. Oh wait, I want that uh, checkpoint. Oh, oh, what are you, motherfucker? Oh, wait, no! Ah, uh, Sonic, you cunt! Why couldn't you just fucking dash against the light? Ah, oh, God. Whatever. Damn! Maybe that's for subsequent playthroughs? I don't know. Yeah, that one's hard to get. I mean, I don't really need the one-ups, they're just fun to get. Do not be scared. Believe in yourself. Or shit, maybe there's an invisible path there? There we are. Get all these rings. Let's relax. Enjoy the game. But what it is. Oh god, no! <laughs> shit, I say as I fucking plummet to my death. Oh god. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that shit. Yeah, the, uh, the capsules don't come back. Because, uh, fuck are you, that's why. No, we want, we want all of them. Oh, shit. Damn, I thought we got closer to the tornado we got before he got sucked up in that shit. Oh, straight up. You should be able to get out of the tornado. This is some cool music. I wish it was louder. Oh shit! Oh god damn! Alright, 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 motherfucker. There we go. I can use this a little bit. Tails to take all the coins for me. wonder if there's anything over here. Nope, nope, just death. Just death. That way is death. Got it. I like I can beat up Tails. It's always fun. Some domestic violence. Here we are. Yeah, this is uh, more of a... I guess it's like an on-rails game, you know what I mean? Oh god, or more on-rails level. Holy shit, look at that. So, uh, hands, hands off, like I said, on-rails. Which, I mean, it's cool from a spectacle perspective. I like the music, I like the visuals. But uh, I don't think this is the best level in the game. Probably Emerald Coast is one of the best levels in the game. Although I think uh, Speed Highway is also pretty cool. There we are. I wonder if you get a light dash down there. Yeah, like I said. This is one of those auto sections. I don't think it's bad or anything. I know some people have a big problem with that shit. But I don't think like, this one in particular does it as much as you would think. Missing some shit. All good. <laughs> Here we are. Beautiful. See those eagles, and I think it's Sonic 06, where you legit have Lord of the Rings style eagles that just take you to the next area, but it happens multiple times. Yeah, I mean it's it's hold forward and win, to be sure. No, nah. Don't let yourself be fooled otherwise. Yeah, we'll, we'll do one more. I mean, shit. What are these levels? Like four minutes apiece? We can do at least one more. There ourselves up for next time. Yeah, not bad. I think I actually really like the ice level too.
The train headed for Station Square will be um, soon. Wait, do we have to go back to Station Square? You can just go right to the ice level. What the fuck happens now? I don't even remember. Go to Station Square. <laughs> you may find, find something. something. Tell me directly where to go. No rhyme or reason. Or no, is the next level is a fucking casino, huh? Yeah, mind blow. Okay, we'll we'll do this. Actually, this one actually takes a while. I remember. Yeah. So let's do exactly that. You get the light dash first too. There's a place somewhere in the city where you can go down into the sewer. I own this building. Well, I'm not sure about this, but kids love to go on little treasure hunts. <laughs> All right. Well, once my son found a weird pair of shoes in the sewer, I told him to put it back, and he ran outside. All right. What's up, video game player? How you doing today, dude? Oh god! Fucking roadkill. Doing well, you? I am doing good. Just relaxing, max and relaxing. Um, did some Sonic CD the other day. That's a hard recommendation for me. Very good game. Um, but what Comcast was doing scheduled maintenance? Of course, they don't tell you they're doing scheduled maintenance. They just let you uh, find that shit out on your own. So uh, the end of that stream was fucking dog shit. And then my internet was down for like two hours. Then on my phone, I like check Xfinity and it's like, oh yeah, it's scheduled maintenance. I hope you don't mind. Well, shit. I, I guess I don't have a choice, huh, motherfucker? My god. I trust Comcast to do some jank shit. There we go. But, um, yeah, internet seems to be doing fine now, so maybe I should bitch a little less. But bitching is so fun. Come on. There we are. Beautiful. We're going right to the casino. Um, but yeah, I think next time I stream this, I'll be finishing it. I've I'm done all the uh, campaigns for this one. So it's just Sonic's campaign left, Go! which is good. The best one. I'd like to save the best for last. And then I think we're going to do maybe like Sonic Spinball tomorrow, then finish up this one the following day, and then... Uh, probably start Sonic 3 and Knuckles, and then also simultaneously while we're playing through that, play through uh, Sonic Adventure Better 2. Better get going. Is that all it does? Hmm. It has a taunt button? I don't know why the fuck there's a taunt button. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Aw, oh, dude. I was fucking laughing my ass off playing this Tails. I don't know why he says hey, hey, hey only when you're racing. <laughs> but it's, it's fantastic. Alright. Let's get some, uh get some coins. I will keep calling them coins. I'm sure to piss off someone. So you could go in the sewers, or you could just play some pinball. Or some card pinball. Let's do some card pinball. And then we'll do Nights into Dreams. Yeah, this one is um, a bit of a grindy level, but I mean, it's, it's fun. <laughs> it's just kind of slow. Although, you know, I've been looking into it. Apparently, some people actually like Sonic Spinball, at least the first few levels of it. I, um, I played it a little bit, but... And I guess I never really, uh, absolutely loved it. Nice call back to the Sega Saturn game. Yeah, I've been kind of curious to play Nights in the Dreams. It seems interesting. That and, uh... What is, what is the on-rail shooter by Sega for the Sega Saturn? Something Dragoon? There we are, nice. Okay, yeah, what the fuck is those called? Panzer Dragoon, yeah. Well, there's uh, Panzer Dragoon, Panzer Dragoon Saga, there's like a whole bunch. But uh, I think Panzer Dragoon Saga is the one people think is like really, really good. Then, what's another? For Sega CD, there's Snatcher. There's, there's a whole bunch of Sega CD and uh, Sega Saturn games I'd like to play, but that shit would have to be emulated because um, I'm not fucking rich. Yo, I swear to God, video game collectors have 
<laughs> have fucked the prices into just next level. Unbelievable. Um, but no, I've, I've been very con um, interested in... Oh, nice. All right. All right. Interesting. I've been very interested in playing like a lot of Sega just in general. I think it's um yeah just un Sega shit is just underrated overall. I'm, I'm not gonna like I'm not gonna get any fights over like you know what's better Sega or Nintendo because um we're fucking full ass grown men but uh and honestly uh, Nintendo for the most part but still like dude Sega's a pretty good alternative. Yeah I'm the same way like there's something how to put it it's like uh there's still mystery you know what I mean there's still a mystery to Sega shit. Whereas with Nintendo, I mean, my whole life, I've fucking, I've, like, mined the shit out of, uh, all potential Nintendo games. There's nothing, there's nothing more to discover. But, um, yeah, like, I picked up that Genesis, uh, Mini. Which, uh, did you, did you ever pick one of those up, video game player? What, for a while, it's like, what, like, 40 bucks, I think? Something like that. Pretty fucking good. Oh, god! I was like looking down. Um, I've tried going to two different retro game stores to see what Dreamcast games I can find. All sports and racing games. I got you. I have um, yeah, I have some like Japanese Dreamcast games uh, and Japanese Dreamcasts, but I don't know what happened to ours. I think just like the disk drive just went. If I had to guess, I think something like that happened. I don't have one of the mini consoles. Oh shit! Oh, look at us running low. I don't have any of the mini consoles. I got you. Yeah, I, I'm hoping that they do more of those mini consoles. I think it's a good idea overall. I mean, obviously, you know, emulation is the way to go overall, to be sure. But if the companies do, like, a fairly priced well put together emulation console with, uh, you know, like a good selection of games. I think having that selection of games encourages you to play those more. Like, it's kind of like directing you to like, hey, try these out. You know what I mean? And I think it's, uh... I think it's nice. I think it's fun. I think it's a uh, good buy. And also just having the, the appropriate controller. Because I think part of judging a system, you know what I mean? Part of judging a system for what it is is taking into account the controller, which I feel like and also just the hardware. So like NES gets a lot of BJs from everyone, right? But a lot of people don't take into account the fact that uh, NES, yo, those contacts fucking suck. That's why people think like, oh, you gotta blow into the system. It's like, no, you just gotta wiggle that shit around. Or dig into the console and clean the contacts thoroughly. It's, it's fucking loose, man. Um, but then, like, 64, for example, that controller is, like, made for aliens. <laughs> like, I, don't, I don't fucking know how else to put it. Yeah, the 64 controllers were... I mean, I, I get it. They wanted to find a way to incorporate an analog stick, you know? <laughs> but there was, there's better ways, man. Try an Intellivision one. I think, uh, god, what, what system was it? The, um... Amiga 32 CD. That that controller is uh, next level. Obviously, I've never held the fucking thing, but uh, just looking at videos of it, like you can just look at it and you you know. All right, we already got uh, 300 coins. How can we get back up there though? I just, I just want to get back up there. I want to get in the back there, please. Dude, this is why this level takes for fucking ever. <laughs> like, I remember this level always taking forever. There we go, hey! And let's see if we can... go up there. Okay, we're gonna fucking... I'll go right now, no, we're good, we're good. There we are, hey! We get another uh, gem, or whatever. I think this is what's giving us the gems around the pillars. I'm not really... I never understood this, to be honest.
Like, it's a cool little bonus thing, don't get me wrong, but it's very bizarre. Hmm. Got some egg timers and shit. Yeah, I'm assuming not all of these fucking things are from uh, Nights into Dreams. I'm assuming it's just a whole bunch of Sega IPs, but maybe it is all Nights into Dreams, who knows. But yeah, I have to give Sega this, even though some of their ports are pretty jank. Um, they do port all their shit to the PC. Well, not all their shit, but a lot of their shit to the PC. And they certainly do a better job than Square. Square ports are so fucking bad. Because they make the mobile port initially, and then they outsource it all to, like, China. Like, the most jank Chinese, like, mobile game creators. Like, yeah, use, use clip art. Yeah, that's what... You know what Final Fantasy VI is missing? Shitty clip art flash character sprites. That's what we need. Make sure it goes through, like, 18 different filters. Oh, my fucking lord. Uh, I, I don't know what the Japanese deal is, just overall, when it comes to porting shit, but they, they always do a horrid job. Um, I remember watching, like, a video on, uh, what was it? The Nintendo Mario 3D All-Stars collection, right? Where there's some, like, weird shit going on in the, uh, that 64 Mario port in, partic in particular. <laughs> oh, God! Are we winning? <laughs> Are you winning, son? I don't know! So help me, God, I don't know! Without further interruption, let's celebrate and suck some dick. Thank you, Alf PRZ. Join us in our celebration. <laughs> I, I don't know why I keep forgetting I have that shit set to the uh, followers notification, <laughs> but it's always a always a pleasant surprise. <laughs> Video game players says, "Good thing I wasn't working this time." Now I've been thinking of like doing like an extra, extra lewd, obnoxious, uh, like you know the um the meme of the guy screaming while he's nutting, like ah that fucking sound clip. I want that. That's what I want. <laughs> I want that, but like mixed with uh some um some gotchy shit. You know what I mean? Like the you know fisting is a hundred bucks, or no? What was he saying? Fisting is three hundred bucks. Part of the uh the get over here, college boy. Ah, oh, it's up to my shoulder! <laughs> I don't know why I, I'm like so fascinated by the shit. Fucking makes me laugh. No, one of my favorites is when uh, Steve Rambo is a uh, like an IT caller. And he's like... <laughs> he's like, shit, they're in the database. I need, I need your password. Throw me some numbers. And he's like entering in like the quadratic equation into Google Earth or some shit. <laughs> like, it's, it's pretty great. <laughs> Damn. Let's just fucking play. Let's play this until we, uh... Until it's at the three hour mark. Wow, I should really think about that, huh? <laughs> We've been streaming for a while. God, this is the longest level in the game. Are we good? Should we just, like... I don't even know. I'm sure we have enough to win. Honestly, to, like, the Chaos Emerald. So what you're trying to do here is get a whole bunch of, uh, coins... See that in the top left? Those are coins, right? So you get a bunch of coins. <laughs> and then you go to the, um, I don't know, like the, the bank vault of the casino. And you kind of empty all of your coins so that way you can get high enough to uh, grab the Chaos Emerald. Uh, video game player said, I streamed for like an extra hour and a half last night. I was determined to finish Fire Emblem after 300 plus hours. Yeah, uh, sometimes when I play JRPGs, right, it, like, it feels like the game is, you know, like, you just feel it, like it's about to be ready to go. You know, it's like, alright, the game, the game's almost done. But then, uh, guess what? The game doesn't fucking end. It just doesn't end. You get 40 cutscenes, you get an extra dungeon, four extra bosses. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah, that's usually what, uh, lasts for a while. No, when I was streaming, um, Final Fantasy VII, that was, uh... Oh god. Oh god, I didn't even mean to do it that time. Well, I streamed Final Fantasy VII, which I'm not a big fan of Final Fantasy VII. Like, it's it's okay. I think that might be one of the most overrated games of all time. But, like, yeah, I, I don't hate it. There's just certain elements of it that I really dislike. Um, 
But yeah, that was the, like the finale for that one. It was a really long stream. Wow, dude, stop it! I just like make my cards go away by hitting R and L. I think I did. New or old? Um, the old one. The uh, I haven't played the new one, but uh, the new one doesn't look that good, honestly. I know some people really liked it. I haven't played it. I shouldn't knock it until I try it. I, I just didn't think it looked that good. Um, it looked, I don't know, kind of generic, honestly. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Good. But, uh, I guess my problem with Final Fantasy VII, right? If I had to... It's very, very linear. I like, I like the music. I like the art. Uh, some people, even people who like it, will be like, Oh, yeah, everyone looks goofy and shitty. I, I admire the art style. I admire the tech behind it. I think it's very impressive. Um, the music is phenomenal. I like the story. The story is actually pretty good. Although, the story is just Sephiroth, Cloud, and uh, Genova. No no one else has, like, any relevance to the plot. Like, they have their own little plot arcs, but they're very isolated. Um, like, after their plot arc is resolved, they're kind of just peripheral. But, you know, I, I, like, I like the main story. It's just, you know, it, it's... The game is very much just about Cloud, Sephiroth, and uh, Genova. Um... What else? What else? Oh, uh, Golden Chocobo side quest is balls. Which is like, that's like the main side quest of that game, you know what I mean? Oh, what's up, Alphurs? I see you, dude. Thanks for the follow, man. I do appreciate it. So, uh, what does that do? Alright, so we do get, I guess you get a, another crystal every time you make a uh, trip here. What do you need to do here anyway? You just need to get a bunch of coins. We're like, we're ready to be done. Or do you mean in the pinball game? In the pinball game, I don't fucking know. <laughs> I, I never understood this. I think every time you make a trip up the thing, and then back down, you get one more gem on those pillars. I've never gotten all the gems. I'm kind of curious to see it, but, uh... I don't know. I thought I was supposed to go through that little... That little path that we made 4,000 times, but I guess not. I guess what gets you a gem is just going up and back down. But uh, I think I think we're good. <laughs> I think we're good, guys. Sorry. Let's uh. Whew. All right. Yeah, we better we better fucking have enough. It may even help show you the way. We really didn't need to do that for as long as we did, but uh, we did, unfortunately. So let's uh, let's grab that shit. Wow, you get zero points. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. I don't know why you played pinball for so long. I bet you have a hell of a Lego collection. Gee, thanks, Sonic. <laughs> All right. The casino level is a classic level of bonus lives. Yeah, yeah but you really don't like. There's a shit ton of lives in this game, in particular. Like, I shit ton. Very, very forgiving game. I like this game a lot, actually. Um, this game definitely has problems, but I don't think it's a bad game at all. There we go. Alright, alright. There we are. How many times have we woken up on the street so far? This game hits too close to home. I guess Eggman's got one of them. But the other one's safe. That guy must be desperate. That means his two to R1, and that's not good. Come on, Sonic! We need to get busy! Oh god, this voice acting. <laughs> voice acting and camera direction. Alright, so uh, I think we're good for now. <laughs> and that's the no good. Remember, kids. Docking with friends can be very fun, but make sure to wash your foreskin first. No one likes dick cheese on their dick. As long as it's not theirs. All right, let's uh, let's, I think I think we're good here. Let's uh, let's check out our progress. And um, next time we stream this, we'll fucking finish this one up. Cause that that is the longest level in the game. Let's see where we're at. Yeah, 25 percent. Um, everything else is done. Everyone else is 100 percent. Sonic is 25. We good. We good. Um, how do we hit back? There we go. So, that is it for Sonic Adventure. Solid game.
good game? Still like it? Very good. Oh wait, let's fucking end game. Get me the fuck out of here, dude. And uh, let me let me show you some of the thumbnails. Yeah, this is a Sonic Adventure. Um, let me uh, show you some of the thumbnails I've been working on. Just uh, for shits and giggles. Go up. Yeah, so there's uh, we'll do one stream of Sonic. There we have um, Cold Steel the Hedgehog. Cold Steel the Hedgehog is great. Ten out of ten. And uh, here's one I made recently for Sonic Spinball. Once again, Google image searching Diaper Sonic and Muscle Tails with the safety filter off. That's something you can't unsee, unfortunately. <laughs> All right, I like this one. <laughs> this one. This one's good. Oh, do you not know Cold Steel the Hedgehog video game player? Oh, that's a classic. Just look up Cold Steel the Hedgehog. Um, it, it's pretty It's pretty great. And we have the Sonic CD, yeah, we, which we streamed. Always fun. Honestly, a good game. I was very pleasantly surprised by this one. Um, Shadow the Hedgehog, the edgiest game ever made. Looking real forward to playing that one. Um, Sonic 3, the Sonic the Hedgehog, and Knuckles and Knuckles and Knuckles. That's going to be a fun one to stream. And yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to be a, a good Sonic month overall. Anyway, thanks again, everyone. Uh, I guess I guess we'll raid someone. Shit. Let's see. Video Game Player says, I thought it had to do with Trails of Cold Steel. Yeah, look up look up Cold Steel the Hedgehog. It's like a real classic meme. Um, but yeah, let's uh, raid our homie Cheapy Hepu. <laughs> I think it's actually a pretty cool dude. So uh, let's do this shit. Um, how, do we, how do you fucking do this shit? Anyway, oh, uh, so for my YouTube peeps... Uh, make sure to check me out on Twitch if you want to join the live chat. Peace out, YouTube peeps.